Uh, my name's Mark Matthews and I live at Maroubra Beach. It's a uh, southern Sydney beach and growing up here surfing my entire life and it's pretty much shaped my career. You know, I was just lucky enough to grow up with some of the best big wave surfers in the world in the Abbott and Brothers and they took me travelling and, and got me, you know, the experience I needed in big wave. You just got to want the wave, you know, more than you're scared of it. Because riding the biggest wave of your life is the best feeling ever, and you just got to focus on that. We're lucky though that we've got a couple of really good reef breaks when the conditions are right, just south of here. I guess the, the closest wave that we've got that's world class and, and heavy in big wave terms is Cape Salando. You know, any time it breaks, you know, we're out there. It's, you know, it's probably my favourite spot in the world. So. I've grown up and Ross and Tom have been my heroes since ever since I was, you know, so first started surfing, you know. Get to go surf with them at you know my home break and, and take them you know to a new spot. Oh, it was unreal. I had a blast surfing with those guys out there. To go with Mark, it's an honour to go out there with him. It's perfect. It's like God, oh, that makes life a lot easier. He's just come on in leaps and bounds. Like I surfed Jaws and I saw him out wide near. Uh, last year actually and we caught a wave together and I, you know, I always was deepest and there was Mark, he was deeper than me. I remember we were paddling back out, <laughs> we'd both ridden a wave and we were paddling back out and one of the biggest sets of the day come through. I don't know, I remember looking up and he just like got stuck on the boil and I could just see him free falling out of the lip on a good 20 foot, it was nuts. Mate, Ross has still got a lot in him, he's still a full blown psycho. <gasps> Oh mate, I love the fact that those two guys are still like charging as hard as anyone at, at their age, you know, 45, 50, I'm 29 now, so it just makes me think, you know, I've got you know, so many more years to be able to keep surfing and keep charging big waves. Um, I'm not sure that I'll, you know, be able to do it as long as I'll do it, but I hope so.